Hi, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to <coughs> install the Post Manager and how to use the Post Manager in Icon 7. First, you need to have Icon 7 in your Revolution account. Log in to your Revolution account and go to Revolution Marketplace. This is the link. I already put the links at the video description. You just need to go to the bottom. <coughs> At the bottom of the video, you click the video description and click into this link. Exactly, you will come into this website. This post manager is zero points, so you can buy it free. First, you just need to click buy. <clears throat> After that, you go to your cart. So I already purchased this. If you not yet purchased, then you can proceed to check out. After you purchase as free, zero point, then you can point your mouse cursor to here and click plug in. <clears throat> then you should be able to find find this post manager in your inventory list of the plugins. You just need to click download. After you click download, then you will get a zip file, post manager zip. You just need to right click and zip extract all. And I untick this, click extract. After finish extracting, it will become a folder as the post manager, the post manager all of this. Again. If I open this folder that extra extracted from the zipped file, so we need to copy this the post manager folder into the icon directory. To open the, the icon directory, you just need to right click the window explorer, click file explorer. Go to this PC, C, somewhere here, program file, Reallusion, Icon 7, bin 64, and where else? Open plugins. Then you copy this. Post Manager, Control C to copy and paste inside the open plugin folder, Control V. After that, you will get the Post Manager. Next, you you can just run the icon. Right click and run as the administrator for the first time. Now I already opened the icons, run as the administrator, you just need to click plug in and I can find from here Post Manager is under Python Samples Post Manager. This is a post manager. Now I will do some demo. First I will just drag in some characters, my own characters.
Now I already have a character. Next, I will apply some motions. Click here. Motion. So now let's say I already have a post, I can just click plus, then it will save one, I can try to play. Let's say if I want this, and plus, now you can see, double click, double click, you already saved the post. I can try to play again. So this one, I can remove the object animation again. Now I try to capture some posts from the motion file. This is a motion file. Let's say now I want this post. I can click plus. Now, so now I have how many posts? I remove all the animations. Let's say post one, the default post two, post three, already capture, and I also can save this. Save as a post library. I can save it anywhere. For example, desktop. This is girl, dance. So let's say this one. If I click this, it will apply both sides from this side to that side. Now I undo. If I click this, it will apply both sides to copy this side. It's very convenient. Let's say if now I click this already, this one I can save as well. Oh, you can see. This is both sides. This is just now. I apply to this, this side. This one I also can save. Now I have I have this symmetry. Now I, I have this. Let's say here the masking, if I don't want I don't want all this to be changed, I can just put it red color. Then this part will not change if I apply any post. See, this part won't change. Because I already locked this part. The red color means you already locked. Lock this hand. Alright, so now if I lock Lock all of this. Now the leg lock already. Now whatever change in the upper part, it won't change the leg. You can lock the finger as well. The finger and the hands. Just use the same method. Let's say now this hand. I don't want this hand to change. Now you can see. Let's say now I I just lock this hand, the right hand, and this. Before I lock it, I unlock first, I put the pose. Alright, now I lock this hand. This is the right hand and here. Right arm and the right hand. To maintain this. You can see, it never changed. This side already changed. And this one never changed. If I unlock this, unlock the hands, then you, you can see the hands still can change. 
you also can just lock some of the fingers. And that's very easy to use. And now if I want this, I also can save it. And I save. Save on the desktop. Girl Dance 02. Now let's say if, if I want to open the, the file just now that I saved, the library that I saved just now, just need to click load. And the 01, just now only three posters. How many posters? Open. Only have three posters. This one already locked. The second files that I that I saved just now, I can open it as well. Girl Dance 02. Now you have seven posters that I saved just now. So can this post be applied at other characters? Yes. I try to drag other characters. For example this. You can apply it in any character as well. If I apply in this avatar, the Goku, so the Sun Goku. You can apply in any character. And you can use all these posts to create motion as well. Open the timeline. In this timeline, now it's Son Goku. So now I try to play. Now, as you can see. Put in the timeline, it, it, it will become motion files. This one I view fit to Windows is better. At this point, apply this. At this point, I apply this. So now, it's already in the timeline, it'll automatically follow. Then you can make your character appear any of the posts at any timeline. This is how can we control the post by using the post manager. It is a really amazing plugin. It is a really awesome plugin that we should go and download and utilize it to create our 3D animation. And that's all for today about the post manager. If you still have the problem to install the plugin, if you still unable to install the plugin, I still have another video tutorial. I already put this link at the, at the video description. How to install all the free plugin for iCron 7. This one, you just need to copy this to, to your browser. Hi. I'm Olivia Wilde, actress, producer, director, mom, and today, hand letterer. Hi, my name is Frida. So, through this video, you, you can install all the free, free plugin for Icon 7. Here I have a very detailed explanation on how to install all the, all the Python plugins. And before you install, you need to go through a few steps. You have to set some settings in your Windows 10 so that make all the Python plugins available in your computer and your Icon 7. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these video tutorials are very helpful to you, you can subscribe to this YouTube channel, turn on the mini bell, select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you'll receive a notification immediately.
see you in my next video.